Greetings from Sweden and Svenska Spelsport Casino, one of the newest members of VOTA. Svenska Spelsport Casino is part of the 100% state-owned company group Svenska Spel AB, as opposed to our sister companies who holds monopolies on scratch tickets and numbers games and the physical casinos we operate on the open licensed market. In addition to all our proceeds going back to the states, we are also one of Sweden's biggest sporting sponsors. Not only do we sponsor federations and national teams, we also have an initiative called the Grassroot Initiative, where a punter can choose up to three clubs that gets a kickback every time the punter places a bet or buys, for example, a lottery ticket. We're also focusing a lot of our sponsoring initiatives on activating children and young adults, getting them into sporting activities. We have a long history of offering pool betting on sports, and that is still the core of our business. As early as in the 1930s, we launched the embryo of what is now Sweden's biggest pool betting product on football, or soccer if you wish, Stryk Tipset. Stryk Tipset celebrates its 90th birthday next year. After the deregulation of the Swedish market in 2019, our license that previously covered the sports betting, pool betting on sports, um, poker and bingo, now also allows for internet casino and betting on horses, something that was previously a monopoly for ATG here in Sweden. Our current offer of betting on horses consists of fixed odds betting on Swedish trotting races and also a collaboration with the French PMU. But since May of last year, we have a rights agreement with the Swedish trotting association Svensk Travsport, enabling us not only to become proud members of VOTA, but also to develop pool betting based on Swedish trotting races. And that has always been our long-term goal and ambition. We believe that having a complete offer of betting on sports and horses will be great and drive our entire affair. It's also our firm belief that um, competition on equal terms will benefit all the stakeholders involved, be it the state or a racing organization. Membership in VOTA and sharing best practices will hopefully help us to achieve our long-term goals and will also legitimize our um, aim at offering pool betting on horses uh, to the Swedish market. With our history of pool betting on sports, we can hopefully contribute with some insights there. We have historically also been in the forefront regarding responsible gaming initiatives and integrity issues, working with that both on a national and in a, on an international level through, for example, GLMS. Even if pool betting historically has been seen as a uh, less of a threat regarding integrity issues, we cannot take anything for granted and we are happy to share our insights in this very important area. It would be a bit presumptuous of us to start by trying to change VOTA. The organisation, albeit being a new one trying to find its ways of working, is first and foremost a trade organisation by pool betting operators with the aim of securing the future for horse racing. And we believe that's exactly where the focus should be right now. Having said that, we hope that the organization can be a strong voice in challenging times. If we really put our minds and hearts to it, we can make a change. The overall economic situation right now, we feel could be a challenge to all of us. Historically, the betting industry has been relatively spared during times of recession, but I think we can all see that that not, might not be the case this time. This uncertainty could of course have impact on how Svenska Spel, Spot and Casino will have to prioritize between different initiatives. In the long-term perspective, I think we all face pretty much the same challenges. We need to recruit new customers and we need to meet their new demands. We must realize that we are part of the entertainment industry and give the punters, our customers, what they demand and want. Joining Svenska Spel, I was quite surprised to realize how far behind sporting operators are when it comes to international commingling compared to the more specialized horse betting companies. 
even if a majority of our pool betting is on um, the universal sport of football or soccer, if you wish, we only have two international partners. And as for our uh, horse betting offer, like I said, we do uh, collaborate with French PMU, but that's about it. But we do hope that our membership in VOTA would, uh, will change that and we are happy to uh, be more internationally engaged. In 10 to 15 years, I hope to be leading a thriving department within Svenska Spel, Sport and Casino with a uh, accepted offer both by the customers and the society of uh, betting on horses, both fixed odds and pool. After battling a year of ill health, I'm just trying to get back to my old routines, starting by eating less and exercising more. But if there's one thing that this last year has taught me is that need to be true and kind to yourself. So I try just to do things that I enjoy. And that could be anything from hanging out with my teenage kids when they allow me. And that is normally when they want something paid. Uh, traveling, cooking, shopping, uh, hanging out with friends, simply doing things that I enjoy doing. Sporting events in general and horse racing in particular are fantastic when consumed live. Being Swedish, I uh, feel I'm expected to uh, say Elite Loppet at Solvalla the last weekend in May. Um, and even if that's a great event, my heart is really in thoroughbred racing. I've had the great opportunity of seeing some of the best racing uh, around the world. Dubai World Cup, Melbourne Cup, um, Cheltenham, Durban July, the list can go on forever. But one of my strongest memories is probably of a race that I never got to see. Uh, the Grand National in 1997, when the racing was abandoned uh, due to a bomb threat. So the Grand National is still on my bucket list, as is Kentucky Derby, Japan Cup. The list can go on forever. That's enough from me. I hope to see you all in a webinar or a racing and betting forum before long. Bye from Sweden. Oh.